Yo, what's going on, sexy sound letter squad? Today we're doing a ranked 1v1. I am playing, well, it's not ranked, it's PTS. But I'm playing Vamana because he has a new ultimate. Uh, well, okay. New ultimate is a little bit of an exaggeration. His healing on his ultimate, which is what he's known for. You always, normally you're always like, oh man, I got to get that anti-heal so that I can deal with this Vamana. Um, it, no, not anymore. He doesn't have any anti-heal, or he doesn't have any healing in his entire kit, actually. Believe it or not. It's literally just, it's literally just uh, a shield now. So basically, what used to be, his shield is 1% of his max health every 0.2 seconds for a total of 5% of his max health. Now, instead, you can build starter items. Oh, oh, me too. Oh, weird. Don't do that. <laughs> um, but in his, his all used to heal you and his all used to give you 1% of your max HP every 0.2 seconds. Now, his ult gives you 2% of his max HP every 0.2 seconds, which basically just means every one second you're ulting, you have a 10% HP shield. So, um, you know, it's a lot. It is definitely a lot. Oh, I really wanted those minions. Why do you clear so much better than me, man? I think he used his, his wing shard just now. Um, it's a lot of, of shielding. That's the only change. Well, I'm sorry, not the only change to his ultimate. Uh, because that healing that you got was kind of dispersed. I guess dispersed is the, the correct way to say that this, this um, into a stat. So you used to heal for free. Now, in order to heal, you have you have 30% life steal. Ouch. So I got this this starter item, by the way, called Carapace Shield. Or Carapace, whatever you want to call it. And basically what it does is when you hit someone, you activate this and then you hit someone, you steal 20 of each protection from them. And when I when it says steal, it means steal. Like I take it from them and I have it. That was the wrong button. And I have it for myself. So Basically, I can remove his his default protections. Look how much damage I do right now. I was doing 68 per auto just then. Oh my god, look at my shield. Look at shield. Whoa. Whoa. Holy. That was like 80% of my health. How long does this last? It lasts for six seconds. So by default, by default, as Vamana, you get 60% of your health as a shield. 60% of your maximum health, by the way. Maximum. So that means building HP and defenses. He died to archers. <laughs> Yo, I lagged. That's crazy. <laughs> oh, God. He'll never live it down. He'll no Yo, I want every... I want... Excuse me. I want at least 50% of the comments on this video to be about how that just happened to J2B. At least half. Also, this is mine because gold. I got his blue and the thingy. Oh, this dude is in... He's in trouble. He's dying to minions. He's losing buffs. What world do you live in, J2B? Certainly not the same one I do. Bro, I take no damage. I am a shield. I am a shield. And 30% lifesteal. You know, this was classified as a buff, by the way. Um, under the patch notes. It was it was classified as 
this god is getting buffed. And I completely agree. I think this is a massive buff. I I think removing the he, the default healing, making it life steal, and then giving you that much shielding. Like you still have the potential to be omega tanky if they buy no anti-heal because 30% life steal is a lot. Um But on top of that, you also just have the the like guaranteed 60% of your health going up to even longer because this can last how long? How long can this last? Uh, da, 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 da. It increases the duration. I don't know how long exactly it can last. I would love to, to... I wonder if JTB knows. How long does Vamana alt last at max? Because at default, it's six seconds. I assume it can go up to like 20. And if that's true, I can have a 200% health shield. Maybe it's more like 15. It's six by default. So I'd assume like 15. Because when you're getting smacked, you can stay in it for a long time. Hold on. Let's try. I want to try. I want to try. I want to try. Okay. One. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven seconds. Maybe my seconds were a little slow, so we'll call it twelve. So, like, twelve seconds. Or maybe my seconds were a little fast and it's ten seconds. I don't know. By the way, that's pretty nuts. That's pretty nuts. Um, oh, I could go Phalanx. I don't have any player-made deployables to help me here. Uh, I want to go HP, and I want to go physical defense. That's like what... Oh, my God. A mitigation build. Yo, I can be immune. There's so much more mitigation items in the game, by the way, that like... Wait, I could genuinely be immune, I think. I'll take that. So like Berserker Shield will give me 10% mitigation. This will give me 20% mitigation. This will give me... Where's Spirit Robe? I don't know where Spirit Robe is. That's going to give me 15%. Um, If I'm Chalk, my ult gives me 80%. I'm like... Uh, or 70%. Bro. What? Hello? Dude, my damage is so much stronger. When I use that, that little, like, item. Hello? We're actually just getting clapped. I think the alt is like really good. It's a little it's a little weird in the sense that like you're used to kind of having that that more fighting potential. Like the uh the extra healing. It's it's kind of become like a staple, right? But I I think is there anything that gives you attack speed and health or and physical defense? No, I already have it. Um well, then give me a second. Oh, I want Emp Armor. Where's Emp Armor? Right here. Emp Armor's OP. Emp Armor got changed. Or not changed. It got buffed. 10% more effective against enemy towers, I believe. Yeah, it got 10%. It got Damage more enemy structures have their attacks be reduced by 10. Yeah, so it, it got 10% better against enemies. Which means it got 10% better for backdooring. Which means, you know, on top of Amana's ult. Can you not bounce me everywhere, bro? 
on top of Amana's alt, um, and Bomber being changed, and the fact that Berserker Shield has mitigations on it, like, I'm just gonna be tanky as hell and impossible to kill <coughs> while slapping the dick off a tower. That's, that's it. That's like, hello, duel. Is there a way to know when the chest spawns or is it random? I think random, but I don't know. I, I haven't, I haven't played enough matches where I've, I've seen. Bro. Bro. This is one item. Look at that back door potential. Bro, I have barely any attack speed and I can do that. How much damage did I just do to that tower? 755? Oh my god. What, now all I would go is like some more attack speed items? I'd, or even more defensive items? I don't really need... Alright, is there anything that I don't... I mean, health is really important. Building HP on Vamana is really important now because the shield you get is percentage health based. So like you want to build health, but you don't want to go over. So let's see here. Um, The next basic attack on an enemy god consumes this. I mean, this could be good to fight, but I don't really need it for backdooring. Like, what? Is there any attack speed health items? There's toxic blade. Attack speed protection items? Literally only berserkers. Okay, so I guess I'll just go toxic blade then. It's the only attack speed health item. And then after toxic blade, I I probably just go straight health. Because I don't need more attack speed. Like, I just need... I just need... What I have, and, th and that's it. Like, he, he has beat stick. You see how ingrained it is in your memory? Do you see how absolutely ingrained it is in your memory? He has beat stick when my alt has no healing anymore. Isn't that incredible? Like, he's... He's... He's doing it. He's doing exactly what I expected. He's doing exactly what I expected people to do. And then I just out-trade him. By the way, I ran into that tower. I ran into that tower range with 1100 HP. I left with 1100 HP. After I tanked the tower and fought him. Okay. That's insane. Backdooring is better. And I hate it. Oh, wanted to hit him. I wonder if he's going to understand his mistake. Like, I wonder if I call him out for it, if he'll be like, oh, shit. You're right. You know, like, I wonder if he'll remember. Uh, Hey, J2B. What's that beat stick doing? Let's see what he says. I don't heal on my alt anymore, brother. He said, oh, and he's going Toxic Blade too. <laughs> it's so damn it great. Oh my God.
it's so ingrained man like you just have to you just have to respect it i can tell you it's doing literally nothing i mean i do have 30 30 percent lifesteal on alt but eh but eh i mean like i'm really not hitting him while i'm alting mainly you got it because his hp regen was like the main part of his kit slowed bro it doesn't even break my shield It doesn't even break my HP shield. Like your HP shield regenerates faster than the tower can do with Emperor's armor. You know, the difference, here's the difference, right? You wouldn't be able to actually, um, like if you were tanking tower before with Emperor armor and everything like that, you would still take damage because your, your, that shield wasn't going to do everything for you, right? But in this case, the shield literally does everything for you. So you just, you're not missing any HP. By the, the time you're done, like, backdooring. So Amp Armor is broken. I don't even have to hit you. This item is busted. Like, look at this. <clears throat> look at this. I walk in with 594 health. While he's hitting me. While he's hitting me, I still have 300. Like, what is that, bro? Like, what is that, man? You got Heartseeker? Oh, Beatstick leaves that little thing on the ground. I don't know. That's kind of cracked. That's kind of cracked. Like I could just go attack speed too, and it'd be it'd be even better to go more attack speed, I think, than more health. Right? And there's no health attack speed items unless you're fighting a mage. If you're fighting a mage, this build is goaded. Because you just build like magical defense. Um yeah, I think, like, I literally... I literally just do this. And then I just, like, run at him. Not him. Like, don't and don't get me wrong. This, this ult is great for fighting potential, too. I'm just not using it for that because I decided to showcase the back dooring because Emperor's armor got changed, too. Like, isn't it crazy, man? I do want Aussie. Aussie's attack speed got reduced a bit. Only by 5%. But the healing and the power went up. With the passive, I should say. See a JTB. Pow, 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 pow. Oh, good catch. Good catch. What did I do there? 3,600 damage to Titan with my ult. And I was still full health because my shield tanked it all. Oh my god. Like, how do you beat that? Actually, how do you beat that? If I decide that I never want to fight you, you can't do anything about it. And by the way, with my ultimate up, even if you have beat stick, which is 40% anti heal, with my ult up, if I'm half HP and my, my Aussie procs, uh, God forbid, I now have 90% anti heal. Actually, that's a lie. It's 80% anti heal.
Bro, I'm just trying to get my Aussie. Bow, 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 bow. All right. Aussie acquired. And upgraded thingamabob acquired. Now, uh, like, I don't think you can kill me in my alt. No matter how hard you try. Like, I, I just have too much healing. Even with beat stick and the damage he has and the sunders and everything, I just don't think he wins. They slowed him. Clear the wave, boys. He wants to kill me. No, the Titan, get him, Titan. His Titan is getting slapped by minions, by the way. He did my treasure. By the way, that was uh, that Phoenix fight. I did that without Berserkers. And Berserkers is certainly an item that you use when you ult as Vamana. Oh, man. This is just not like... Uh, what do you do here? Bonk. Hey, GG, J to B. You tried. Hit him a wave. Pow, 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 pow. Dude. Backdoor of Amana is 100% better. Like 100% better. His alt got better for backdooring because you removed the healing, you added a shield, and shielding is better for backdooring because you don't actually lose the health, right? Like, the problem with Vamana alt and the backdoor at the moment, like in Season 9, is that you have to lose the health to heal the health. As a shield, you're gaining HP. Like, you're, heal you're all going over max HP. So you walk in with 1,100 HP, you walk out with 1,200 after your alt is over after you've taken their tower you know what i mean like emperor emperor's armor's got 10 percent better literally nothing you can do to counter it anti-heal doesn't work anymore sunder for shield maybe plus like true damage so maybe bakasura Or Kali with Kins. Like, maybe that's all you can do to counter it. I know Kali with Kins isn't isn't true damage, but it's a really high attack speed with percentage health. I don't know. 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 It's it's insane. It's incredible, honestly. Because I did that. I I backdoored, by the way, with two defensive items. Berserker Shield and Emperor's Armor. If I was if I was against a, a mage here, I would go Talisman of Energy and Shoguns and Emperor's Armor. And then I would just go prob I would probably keep the Aussie over the Hasten Katana. The Aussie seems really, 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 really good. I love Aussie as an item now. Um Yeah, I don't know. It's in it's insane. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and uh come over to my Twitch channel where I'm probably live right now. Peace.